Hello, Your Majesty, and welcome to Friday. Well, it's going to be a very difficult weekend, I think, for the Leos. There's a lot really going on for you, Your Majesty. For starters, the moon today conjunct Pluto in the house of inner child. This really deals with you letting go of childhood issues or issues that really prevent you from being in touch with your more creative or expressive self. In the last 24 hours, there was an expansion, an awareness expansion emotionally of just how much of a star you could be. This is the house of star power, the house of Leo. And what that comes down to as far as being a star is you expressing your heart and your true inner child in the moment. When you are in your inner child, your majesty, the world flocks to you. You and Aries share that to some degree. Now today on top of that, the universe is saying it is the birth of Leo 2.0. And do you know where Leos actually gain their power from the universe? They gain it from being themselves in the moment. You see, you are a magnet of gravity. And when you are in touch with your inner child and you are vibrating that out like the sun vibrates rays to all the planets, your ruling planet, by the way, is the sun if you don't know, you draw people in. Your magnetism draws people in. Your charisma draws people in. Your power is your charisma. And you can look to a lot of famous Leos to see that as clear. So in the last 24 hours, Venus has conjunct Saturn. That says to me, Leo 2.0 has officially been born. Now you maybe haven't been inaugurated yet, but you have been elected to your new power. And look for in the next six weeks, leading up to the sun in your birthday period conjuncting Saturn for your actual inauguration. This is the lead up I've been talking about for Leo 2.0. Now today through the weekend, today you have the opportunity to let go of old emotional baggage about the star you thought you would be, really starting to understand the star you will be. But through the weekend, the moon will be in Capricorn, pulling your emotions into the immediate moment. So you'll be sunny and hyper aware for the weekend. If you've been under any kind of emotional stress, this is a time I find that people manifest illness. So be very careful. Your emotions and your body really are working as one. And you want to be careful not to let just old emotional crap pour into it. All right, Your Majesty, that's all we got for the weekend forecast. Good luck with that birth. And until then, live, love, be. So good.